Good morning and welcome to This is Another Day. Today's scripture reading comes from the book of Acts, chapter 17, verse 28. And God gives us the power to live, to move, and to be who we are. We are God's children, just as some of your poets have said. Each one of us is gifted with ability, calling, potential, and deep purpose from God. We may often feel as if this is not true, especially if our hopes for ourselves do not match with society's unrealistic expectations. We endeavor to reinvent ourselves constantly by exploring new ideas, new careers, new passions, new expressions of ourselves, which are all worthy pursuits. But we often fail to remember the intrinsic and innate worth and value we already possess by virtue of the fact that we are alive and belong to God. We could not earn it or merit it. This inner treasuring of us by God is expressed most candidly in Christ's sacrifice on the cross on our behalf for the sake of love and his resurrection. We are infinitely worthy in the eyes of a God of infinite worth, and in thanksgiving and gratitude, we delight and revel in this God who simply says to us, My child, just come to me as you are. This is another day to remember to whom we lovingly belong. Anchoress and mystic Julian of Norwich wrote, Our Savior is our true mother in whom we are endlessly born and out of whom we shall never come. We can rest in the Divine One in whom we live and move and have our being. So Lord, Help us to be renewed today and every day in you. Instill within us the peace of knowing that in you we are enough, a peace that only you can provide and that the world cannot. May this peace comfort us and stir us towards radical love of others and of ourselves. Thanks for being with me today, and I'll see you soon. Bye.